Today is Memorial Day, a day when America remembers those who sacrificed their lives in the service of the United States military. Each year, the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps demonstrate a wide array of displays, ceremonies, and other events for seven days for New York City's Fleet Week. Let's go now to Rocket Boom NYC's Ella Morton with further details. Thank you, Molly. I've come down here to the USS Intrepid, which is one of the most iconic places for the activities of Fleet Week here in New York. Go Navy! I'm on the Intrepid flight deck with Luke Sachs, who's the head of public relations. Now, uh, it's been Fleet Week here in New York since May 26. What actually is Fleet Week? Fleet Week is when uh, soldiers from the military and uh, other military personnel come to New York City to enjoy some time off. Um, they dock their ships here in Manhattan and in Staten Island, and uh, they get out into the city, they enjoy everything New York City has to offer, the restaurants, the attractions, the museums. And equally as important, it gives the people of New York City uh, the chance to thank the soldiers and the sailors for everything they do for us every other week of the year. All the people of New York really are appreciative of everything they do and they show them this week. What's the relationship between Memorial Day and Fleet Week? Well, you know, obviously Memorial Day is a chance to pay tribute to men and women uh, that have given their lives in service to this country. You know, what better time than Fleet Week when we have all these, you know, wonderful men and women of the military here. You know, here at the Intrepid we do a, um, a ceremony up here on the flight deck. Um, we have thousands of troops, uh, active, retired veterans here. Uh, we unfurl a 100-foot American flag um, being held all along the outside by these veterans and intrepid former crew members. Um, it's a very serious ceremony. We do a wreath laying um, in honor of those men and women that have given their lives in service to this country. And uh, it truly is a very special day here. So what are some of the events that have been available to us civilians this week? Well, at the Intrepid here on Wednesday, we had the Parade of Ships, uh, which is when the ships actually came into New York Harbor. They went right by the Intrepid on the Hudson River. They go up to the George Washington Bridge, come around, and you can see the Iwo Jima Park right behind us. We've had Broadway performances. We had uh, American Idiot, Hair, Promises, Promises, and Million Dollar Quartet on the stage yesterday. We have the Rockettes coming. Uh, we've had the Coast Guard giving a search and rescue demonstration. You know, we've got uh, Vet Dogs here, which is an organization that works with uh, dogs to train them to work with men and women in the military once they've returned from combat. You know, in addition to all those things going on for Fleet Week, we have everything else that we normally have here at the Intrepid. Just the general exhibits we've got here, all the, uh, the artifacts and the aircraft and things that, uh, you know, make the Intrepid so special. Another event is the Tug of War. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Absolutely. Uh, one of the most popular events during Fleet Week is the Tug of War. Different branches of the military compete against each other and take it very seriously. You know, myself personally, I love all the military teams, but I got to pull for our own Intrepid team this year. So that's Fleet Week, a great celebration of our men and women in uniform. And no one does it like New York City. I'm Ella Morton, and you've been watching Rocket Boom.